clean clothes and warm food for Christmas. It's a necessary gift for hundreds of families struggling during the holidays. NBC 4's Vicki Vargas is live in Santa Ana where volunteers provided pancakes and fresh laundry. Vicki. Yeah, it turns out those volunteers are from Operation Warm Wishes, and they really just finished a laundromat marathon here. The washing machines, the dryers, only part of what made this Christmas so special for hundreds of families. The organizers of Operation Warm Wishes say for some families, this is a luxury, a day to wash, dry, fluff, and fold, and at no cost. And they were willing to wait hours to walk away with clean clothes. I have to do repeatedly laundry, and Operation Warm Wishes has helped me. You know, bringing my laundry over here is a big deal. It's like 40, 60 bucks. It's like, you know, that's a lot. It's a lot. Marta says her son has a medical condition that won't allow him to hold down food, which leads to piles and piles of laundry. Two years ago, she was living in a park. Today, she has an apartment, but still can't afford a Christmas tree. There's a lot of kids now, and just like us, that we need clothing, washing, and all that. And it's just pretty supported that he's there for us. He is Tyron Jackson. All right, for this wonderful turntable. A counselor and teacher who was once homeless himself. So many families that have to battle between putting gas in their tank or doing their laundry, putting food on the table, or doing their laundry. And oftentimes, kids and families have to wear their clothes over and over again. You know, and it's been raining, so especially for our homeless, you know, a clean pair of clothes is, and warm clean pair of clothes is amazing. So it's super important. This Christmas extravaganza included holiday toys donated by some of Jackson's students at Tustin Unified. By the end of this day, more than 250 children will go home with a gift. More volunteers have come to flip pancakes and provide a warm meal. And others, like Tracy Mensis, collected enough quarters for the washers and dryers. People think to, to feed the homeless or those in need and to maybe give presents at Christmas, but who thinks that having clean clothes is one of the most important things that we all normally take for granted? Indeed, the Christmas cheer at this holiday party can be measured in the size of the load and the smell of clean clothes. So, how much laundry? Well, they started about 8 this morning, called it quits around 2 this afternoon, and they estimate they did 125 commercial size loads of laundry. Kim and Kathy, Merry Christmas back to you. Mm -hmm. oh, safety.